from the front. I will go with behind. trail have been used but yesterday. I wonder where it is lead. Underlay. Yeah, ain't no need to staggering around out there any longer. The old claim's petered out, Ruby. I reckon we better head for town. Well, that suits me all right. How would you like me to make you some lunch? And am I hungry? Say, I could eat a whole can of beans, including the can. <laughs> <laughs> Water there. We may need this place. Stay here.
Buenos dias, senor. I hope I do not intrude. Now listen, Omri. I don't talk no flowery language, and I'm too tired to make any bows. So let's get right to the point. Who are you and what do you want? <laughs> you amuse me greatly, senor. I am come but to beg permission to water my yard. You see, I am your neighbor. Neighbor? Si, sí, senor. I am live but a few miles beyond you. My name is Don Yorba. I ain't refused anybody any water, so help yourself. You're very kind, senor. Do you live here alone? Sometimes. This is our neighbor, Don Yorba, Ruby. How do you do, Mr. Yorba? This is an unexpected pleasure, senorita. You have to excuse me, please. Don't have to think But one oil? Yeah. Tomorrow, senor, in exchange for the use of the water, I will bring to the senorita a set of bread food. Is it a bargain? No welcome to the water. To itself, of course. It will be here tomorrow. Adios, amigo. There's plenty of water. Also a very young and beautiful senorita. Tomorrow, we bring it on. We'll carry her away. Uh, what about the old man? The boys will attack the place. I will rescue the girl. And the old man? Well, he's too bad, but he will be killed. Just another tragedy. Just another romance in the life of Pandro Zan.
There's not a rat in that bamboo. the yard when I find you gone. Who'll be there? I have seen no one. Shuck, he must have been up the spring. See, I gotta go to town for the vision and leave her behind. Bueno, you would perhaps bring me some bacon and flour, no? I would pay you well. Give me a horse and I'll hold him down for you. And in return for this, I will take good care of your granddaughter. Well, certainly appreciate your kindness. Pablo, the yard. Get his provisions with ours as well. Um, I go to carry away my new romance. They'll be watching us, Ruby. We gotta keep going. Okay, Pop. I'm all right. We gotta cross the river. Go ahead. I'll get out of this trouble. Give me the glass, Joe. There's a girl in the pack, and I can't swim. Girl, it was in the pack.
hunt. Them renegades after my girl. And I'm sure appreciate your help. Certainly, old timer. It's only three miles to town. Come on. I guess we're safe, Ruby. Thanks to the stranger. Tony's all right. Well, I sure hope so. He'll be coming for his horse soon, I reckon. Some animal. Looks like a thoroughbred. He is a thoroughbred, ma'am. Well, stranger, I guess Ruby and me just about owe your life. Oh, you don't owe me anything, but tell me, what was it all about? Well, sir, this morning a stranger rode up to the house and he says to me, he says, Butted in and they got away. Ride back and get the rest of the boys. We have very important business in town tonight. Sure enough, they trailed us. I convinced them that I'd left Ruby behind. Everything was all right. We crossed the river. Well, what was that stranger's name? Called himself Andrew Zanty. Zanty? Yeah. I'd only know. I'd like to meet him. Face to face. Well, son, I can fix that up for you. In return for your kindness today, I'll take you right where you can find it. See, I've got a cabin down on the edge of the town. 
you put up there. Besides, I want you to meet the sheriff. Sandy is the worst outlaw the state has ever known. Half white, half Apache Indian. He poses as a Mexican, speaks the language, but he's not a Mexican. Tell him about deserters. Plano. Go ahead. I will be waiting. Now, I think the best plan is to split up. Make temporary camps about 10 miles apart along the desert. We're sure to spot him sooner or later. John Tobin here and me here are heading out that way in the morning. For $5,000 it's worth going at. Hey, everybody, duck. Don't open that door. I'm giving orders here. you, eh? What you got here? And how'd you get it? What difference does it make as long as I've got it? Might make a lot of difference. I'll take charge of this. Nice, agreeable, and appreciative sheriff you got here. Yeah. He started off all right, but he's sure going to see. Now, boys, I'm suspicious. How'd he know it was Sandy? How come he got this money without getting shot? I'm going to keep an eye on him. He and old Dusty are heading for the desert in the morning. I'm going to take a couple of boys and follow. He might lead us right to Sandy. I tell you, I don't trust nobody. Well, here it is, son. Pretty comfortable, too. Come here. Wow, old wine tunnel. Keep the trail up above. I come in mighty handy sometimes. Big trouble. Hey, Geez, you got plenty of water. This being government ground, reckon I'll stay right here. What a pleasant place this is gonna be. Well, your friend Tobin's been gone five days now. Wonder where he's eating. You'll be grub with him. Yeah. Mighty funny him skipping out of here without us knowing about it. Didn't leave no trail neither. Well, he likes to work alone. That's his excuse. Dusty, you ain't smart. Now, ten to one, if I could have trailed him, he'd have let me right to Zanty.
Better take charge of him, Sheriff, before I cheat the law. So I finally captured you, eh? Come on. I reckon that'll hold you. Well, I'm not so sure. This is my business. I ain't never lost a prisoner yet. <laughs> you never had one to lose. It'll be back day after tomorrow. We'll be taking you into town. You've been a slick cunning wolf, Sandy, but I finally got you. You forget, Senor Sheriff. Wolves run in packs, and mine is not far behind. I gotta get going, Dusty. Because I got a growing desire to go over there and break into pieces. You know, just how you feel, son. Tell Ruby I'll be home in a couple of days. All right, old timer. Drop that gun, Coleman. Unbuckle your belt. Don't be a fool, Sheriff. The man who did this is getting away. Yeah? The man who done this is right in front of me. I had you figured out right along. Hmm, got him in the head, eh? What's this? I suppose you're denying that's yours. Get your hand out here. Come on, get moving. of a kind, eh? Own up, Zanny. This fella double-crossed you and brought you in here just to get the reward. Ain't that it? You're very wise, Senor Sheriff. Sure I am. Hello, boys. Glad you got here. Miller, run into town and tell the boys I got Zanny. And that ain't all. Tobin here killed old Dusty. Bring all the boys you can get. We might bump into Zanny's gang on the way to town. Okay, Sheriff. Thanks. You stay here and keep an eye on them. I'm going to Indian Springs and get Slim.
Look out, Hank. So that's how you got a way to kill Dusty. Your deductions are much better than the sheriff's. I knew you did it, all right. You're the only one that could have taken my knife. What'd you come back for? To wait for this opportunity. Soon you will be with your friends. And there will be only two left. The senior sheriff and his man will return from Indian Springs. I will be in ambush. And Zampi will go free. Senor. Three. Dusty, the two horses ready. Easy now, son.
Drink your fill, Zanty. It's poison. I go back without them, my reputation's ruined. And they're holding them a prisoner over at your old place. But I just can't believe he did it. Sheriff caught him right in the act. Sure sorry, Miss Ruby. strange how they broke out of here. I know. Sandy got out, broke the chain that held Tobin, overpowered Hank, and then shot him. I always knew them two was in cahoots. Why not stop her? If they're holding Pandro, we'll make them exchange prisoners. Down, boys. There's only one other place. The shack for the spring. Let's raid it and get him out. Someone to take care of you. It seems to me you're doing very well.
Must be Zanny's gang. We've got to race for it. The girl in the ember that got Pandro are just ahead of us. Boys, we got him trapped. Get away this time. Hands up. Just a minute, there, Sheriff. Don't think, you old fool, I ain't dead yet. But that shot and the knife. Oh, shucks, I want shot. And for the knife, there's only a scratch. The fella that done it's inside. Come on. The dead man called Zanti. He's the fellow that knifed me. What's that? That's Zanti's gang. Go ahead and let him out, Sheriff. We'll help you. All right. You men might just as well know I got you. Come on out one at a time. Your guns in your holsters and your hands reaching high. Stand up against that wall. That's it, keep him covered. You bet. Come on, get over there, get over Hello? Is this Sheriff Tobin? Yes, Mrs. Tobin. This is the Sheriff. And what would Sheriff Tobin like for his dinner tonight? Anyhow. They care. Big juicy steak smothered with onions and a apple pie. Boy, will I go for that. Mm -hmm. 